I'm aware of that. I'm, you know, I'm okay. I'm feeling good about this now, and and I can, you know, trace that back. I'm feeling good about it because I can see a, a positive, positive uh, outcome of this. And and then the next day, I'm feeling bad about it because what my, where my mind is, I, I can see the consequences of a, you know a negative. Well, here's the that. thing. So, so let's say so you know. I'm, I'm, I'm very aware that it is my thinking. Well, hang on. I, I, it, I, I don't it just doesn't, he it just, just oh, let, put it this way. It didn't help me <laughs> in, in dealing with this situation. Uh, see, I don't think, uh, it, uh, and forgive me, it, it, yeah, yeah. it doesn't seem to me like it was ca at any point in there that it was ca you were coming from clarity. So let's say... Let's say we've got uh, Bob. Here's Bob. Um, Bob has a brainwave one day. Bob decides he's going to rob a bank. He's like, he's had some financial trouble and that sort of thing. He's like, if I rob a bank, That'll sort everything out. So he gets this idea. He's feeling great about it because he's thinking about how much fun it's going to be to go to Barbados and have people bring him umbrella drinks. And he's just like, he's flushed with it. He goes to sleep that night. He's like, oh, man, I'm, I'm going to get started tomorrow morning. So he's like, his head's full of upside. Next morning, he wakes up. He feels terrible. He's like, oh God, I could get caught. I could get shot. Someone else could get hurt. Oh, I'm just seeing all the downside. It feels awful. What I'm not saying is, let's get him up back to upside so he can make a good decision. What I'm saying is gonna do something for him is he needs some clarity. When he was seeing upside, He's lost in outside-in superstitious thinking. Thinking about how all this well-being was going to come from the money and the... Well, all, the, all those feelings are coming from within him. They're not coming from the money or the... They're coming from within him, but he ain't seeing it. When he wakes up in the morning and he's seeing all downside, and he's feeling awful, oh, how terrible my life would be if I went to jail and that sort of thing, He's lost in superstitious thinking. He's still not seeing it. He thinks he's feel in, when he's seeing upside, he thinks he's feeling the positive outcomes. When he's lost in downside, he thinks he's feeling the negative outcomes. That's not clarity. That's bullshit. It doesn't work like that. It's inside out. So what I'd want for Bob, before he goes putting his plans into action or canceling his plans. Maybe it is a good idea, but he needs to see it right before he goes hitting any banks. What I want for Bob is for him to get some clarity about how the system works. How the system works is unrelated to outcome. How the system works is how the system works. And when he sees how the system works, He'll stop toggling between superstitious outcome-based feeling states and he'll slip into something more profound based on a knowing about what the next step is for him to take. Does that make sense? And so it looked to me, David, uh, with, with all due respect, like you were uh, going between upside and... Now, whenever anyone's toggling between upside and downside thinking, they're lost in a superstition. And it's not that there aren't upsides and aren't downsides to a, a course of action. There absolutely are. But when you're understanding how the system works, you can make far better decisions about what, what relevance those things have. I guarantee when someone's lost in, should I do this or should I do that, or that, they're lost in a misunderstanding. They haven't got their clarity.